<clears throat> so with Dariano, we came up with, uh, with a, a, a way of thinking about consciousness that makes a lot of sense to me. And, and that is that, that uh, if you start with consciousness and free will existing, we can then explain why quantum physics has to have the crazy properties that, that, they, that it has. Specifically, we can explain why quantum information has to have has to have the no cloning theorem and no Olivos theorem, uh, which you can discuss a little later, and then why the collapse of the wave functions cannot really exist as such, but it is a expression of a free will decision of a field that is that has consciousness and free will. So consciousness and free will are then causing, in a sense, the physics, which is the 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 informational aspect, not the meaning aspect, not the semantic aspect, but the informational, the semantic aspect of reality to manifest the way it does. Um, so, you know, with this theory then, not only does it make sense to start with a conscience and free will existing, you know, existing and being true by definition and being fundamental properties of all the fields, of quantum fields, the, elect, you know, the quantum field of electrons is conscious, is self-knowing, is in within the consciousness itself. Uh, and the symbols used to communicate, which must be shareable, existing in space-time, are the excited states of the fields, which are what we call electrons. But the electrons then in this idea, in this, in this way of understanding reality, are just the symbolic aspects of reality where the semantic aspect of reality are within the field itself. Mm -hmm. So uh, this theory seems to, you know, to then explain, uh, to, to really show that our conscious experience is in particular qualia, that is the perceptual way in which we understand reality, we, we begin to understand reality, we have these sensations and feelings that allow us to understand reality, that perceptual are represented by quantum information because quantum information is private, it cannot be reproduced, no cloning theorem, and also what we can say about or we can measure about that state is only one bit per quantum bit. 